What's going on, Tackle Warehouse fans? Thomas here bringing you this week's episode of What's New at TW. All right, the iCast show may be over, but we are still getting a ton of new iCast products. Seems like every single week we got some stuff trickling in. So thank you for tuning in, checking out what we got in the shop for you this week. So let's jump right into it. I'm gonna show you guys first a heavy hitter that comes in at a feather weight weight class thing. This thing is nuts. This is the Abu Garcia Xenon MG LTX. This is the lightest and most compact casting reel Abu has ever made. Comes in at four and a half ounces. So if you're looking for that super ultra lightweight setup, this is the reel you wanna check out. I mean, you pair this with a lightweight rod, lightweight rod, you're not gonna feel it at all. Now, not only is it super lightweight, but this thing is incredibly smooth. It's super powerful. You know, it's got 11 bearings in this thing to ensure it's super smooth. And you know, I know a lot of people, eh, just throw a bunch of bearings in there, it doesn't matter, it'll make us, no, these are 11, quality bearings. I always believe that quality over quantity on those bearings is key. In this case, you get both, a ton of them, and they're super nice. Has their super light, uh, super light spool concept design on here, so it's really, really, really smooth. Uh, you're gonna be able to cast lightweight lures a long way, bigger lures a long way as well, but just a really premium, awesome new reel. Now, this is their flagship reel, so it is gonna come with that flagship price point. You're looking at 550 bucks for this thing here. So let us know, what, what do you guys think? Do you think 550 bucks, are you picking up one of these? Are you picking up like five of their Max Series reels? You know, the options are out there. I'm curious what you think. Let us know in the comments below. All right, done with hardware. Let's take a look at some other cool stuff. So first one, I wanna talk about a new swim bait from Gancraft. This is the Gancraft Ratchet Swim Bait. This one I'm really, really excited about. So it's got a, cool, a lot of cool things going for it. So first it's a floating design. So you're gonna be able to work this one right below the surface. Kind of where it differentiates itself from some of the other swim baits on the market is that this one's geared to be really versatile. You can work it slow. It's gonna get that lazy S motion that you see with a lot of glide baits. Or if you wanna use a higher speed reel, kick this thing into a high gear, it's gonna have a nice, really, really tight swimming action. It's gonna get that action from the multi-jointed body, but especially it's coming from their range of motion design on this one. So it has their ROM tail and this ROM joint. So it's actually a soft joint at this back one here. And then this tail just really a super, they kind of tapers out wide, but starts really thin. So you get just a really, a ton of motion out of this thing. So you're gonna get incredible action, nice floating design, a lot of versatility out of this thing, premium hardware, really sticky sharp, treble hooks on there, you're not gonna need to swap these things out when you're already investing enough money in the bait itself. You don't need to get new hardware for it. And I mean, the paint jobs on this thing, incredible. So new, new glide bait to check out from Gancraft. All right, let's go soft body. We're gonna still tick, stick towards the top of the water column here. We're gonna start out with the Net Bait Bait Fuel BF Toad. Super cool little toad. I had the pleasure of taking this thing for a test run a little bit before it came out on the market. And man, let me tell you, this thing catches fish. Gets you a ton of bites. Uh, you can run this with just an EWG hook. You can run it on the back of your buzz bait, a uh, little double hook if you want, a double frog hook. So the options are endless with this thing. Has their bait fuel scent technology right in there. So it's gonna get those fish when they do blow up on this thing and they will, cause the action on it is incredible. But that bait fuel technology is gonna get them to hang on a little bit longer. Everybody knows with frog fishing, you know, maybe more so on the hollow body side, but frog fishing in general, sometimes it can be a little bit tough to get a hook in those fish. So that bait fuel technology, getting them to hang on a little bit longer is really, really helpful with these things. But you're getting a ton of motion, ton of crazy action, good bubble trails off the legs on the back here. Uh, the body design has a nice cavity on the top of this, so your hook point is really gonna sit deep in that channel. So you're gonna be able to come through cover fantastically. You can pause this thing next to key structure, over key structure, it's not gonna get hung up. So just a nice new soft body toad for you. Pretty cool one, I'm excited to, to put it to more use this year. I already got to take it out a little bit. Uh, let's take a look at another soft plastic here. We have the Yum FF Sonar Minnow. Really cool design here, designed by the man himself, Bassmaster Classic champ, Jason Christie. I mean, I should be able to put this thing down. Enough said right there. If he designed it, you know it's good. But we'll talk about some of the features on this one. So Sonar Minnow, it's getting its name from, you know, some of those anglers that are using the active target, that forward-facing sonar technology. That's what this thing is really designed for. So if you're targeting some of those you know, more difficult to catch suspended fish and you're using that fancy new sonar, this thing is really gonna help out. You'll be able to see it on your graph well and target those hard to catch fish. But look, not everybody has those fancy units up on the front of their boat like myself. This is still just a killer finesse bait. So absolutely, on a little ball, ball head, you know, fishing that live target uh, sonar or just drop shot, whatever the case may be. It's got this nice little fork tail that quivers really well and you know, has that yum F2 scent technology in it. Nice detailing on here, the checkered scaling patterns and just some killer colors to choose from. So just an awesome little finesse bait that absolutely will work with some of those new sonars, but just on itself, you know, drop shot, little ball head, vertically presented, whatever you want to do with the sink, it's going to get you a ton of bites. All right, let's go back to a hard bait here. We got a new one from Riot Baits. 
We got the Riot Baits Revolt 426 crankbait. So 426, it's four to six foot range. That's where you're gonna be targeting with this thing. I like this one a lot. It's got kind of an interesting body here. So you can kind of see the body shape on this one. It starts really bulbous, but then immediately tapers down aggressively into that more slender tail. So it's gonna give you a really you know, hard, wobbling, erratic hunting action. And give also with these uh, rattles in here, you're gonna get a ton of sound to this one too. So you're getting incredible action from the bill and that body, but you're also getting that acoustic layer with all those BBs uh, jammed in there. So I mean, absolutely some clear water presentations with these nice detailed paint schemes. But with that, you know, hard hitting action and all those rattles in there, if you're navigating some of the dirtier waters, bunch of algae, mud, whatever the case may be in your water column, this one may be one that you wanna turn to because it's really gonna call those fish in from a long way off or when the visibility is not great. So a cool new crankbait to check out, one of the iCast release from uh, Riot Bait here. All right. So let's take a look at some line. We got a cool new one from Vicious. We have the Vicious Fishing Easy Leader Pro Series Kit. A ton of anglers, especially when we're dealing with high pressured fisheries or you know clear water fisheries, so those clear water deep reservoirs, a lot of us are using the braid to fluorocarbon leader. You're getting a ton of sensitivity out of that one. Uh, and it's really, really hard for those fish to see that fluorocarbon line. But one of those challenges, sometimes anglers don't really know how to pair up their braided line with their fluorocarbon. You know, what size to pair it up with. Well, Vicious is gonna take all the guesswork out of that. So in this package, you're gonna of course come with your braid, but it's also gonna come with a liter size spool of fluorocarbon. So it's gonna take the guesswork of, you know, matching up these, your braided line to your fluorocarbon options. So you're still gonna get all that great sensitivity, no stretch, catch a ton of fish, but now you don't have to figure out how to mix and match these things together. The last thing this kit also comes with is five of their leader tie systems. So, you know, I, I'm more comfortable with actually tying the line to line knot, but maybe you're not, or maybe you're, you know, doing it on the fly on the deck of your boat and you don't want to take the time to, you know, tie that complicated line to line knot. Well, they include five of their easy leader attachment systems. So you're able to just tie it right on there, add your leader line, spool it up, and you're good to go. So pretty cool, no hassle kit from Vicious. All right, well, that's the stuff we got to fish with. Let's take a look at some cool new accessories. We got a couple new shades from Waterland. All right, so we actually have lady specific shades for all my female anglers out there. You know who you are, we're awesome. We love seeing you on the water here. Well, now we got some cool shades designed specifically for you. So we have the Lotties right here and the June right here. All right, you know, ladies, absolutely, but maybe if you're more of a fashionable fellow, I mean, even though I got this great tribute to Alan Jackson on my face, I don't think I can pull these off, but there's still some hot shades. If you guys have used those Waterland glasses, you know these are really premium uh, glass sunglasses. They got great polarization. You're gonna be able to see through the water really well, really comfortable, lightweight. You know, I can wear them all day on the water. I really enjoy fishing with these things on. And they're, you know, not just fishing, you know, driving out around town, just everyday wear. These are some premium sunglasses you're gonna to wanna to check out. All of them come with a nice little nifty carrying case and a mini cleaning cloth inside. If you're looking for a more full size cleaning cloth, Waterland's got us there too with a Waterland jungle cloth. You know, ton of different microfiber cloths out there and cleaning cloths. This one's kind of unique. I like this one a lot. So you have this uh, fuzzier exterior. So that's gonna be great for pulling off any grime or bigger things. And then on the other side, it has, you know, your more traditional microfiber cloth side. So pretty cool, like, you know, like I said, nice little unique cloth. Great for your sunglasses, of course, but more than that, if you're cleaning off, you know, a quick wipe off of the electronics on your boat, cell phone, whatever the case may be, if you need to see it clearly, that cloth is gonna help you do just that. All right, last thing we're talking about today, we got the new Mega Bass Clear Pouch. So just a super convenient pouch to add whatever you want here. Tools, plastics, hard baits. Maybe you want to throw your cell phone in there, keys, whatever the case may be. If you have a, th a thin graph, you can actually, you know, care for your graph when you take it off the boat, slide it in here, whatever the case may be. Just a nice handy thing to have. Keep you more organized. Keep your stuff pr protected. You know, throw this in your gear bag or just in your boat locker, whatever the case may be. And it's going to keep that stuff nice and protected. All right, cool. That's all we have to talk about today for all the baits and stuff. But remember, we always have cool new apparel coming in. We don't talk about it too often on the What's New Tackle Ross, but we always have a ton of new apparel coming in. I'm wearing a new option from Hook right now. I like it a lot. It's got the bass hits on there, some cool colors. So we just got a ton of different apparel on there. Always new stuff coming in stock. So make sure you check that out on tackleross.com. As for the rest of the stuff, you can learn more about it or shop for it using the link in our description below. And uh, if you enjoyed this video and want to see more like it, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And let us know in the comments. Like I said, maybe that Xenon. Are you getting one of those? Are you getting five of the other reels? Uh, are you excited to use that new Gancraft swim bait? Let us know in the comments. We want to hear from you guys. We'll see you all next week.